Hi guys, a quick tip to help you with your business. Let's talk about too many plugins on a WordPress site and what it can do, the damage it can cause. Now I'll give you a case study. This week I was approached by a client in Melbourne who reached out and asked me to fix her site. Now the problem she had with her site was it had a huge blue circle across the face of the homepage, both on desktop and mobile versions. Now, after some squirreling around, I found that it was the problem I suspected it was, which was too many plugins, and a conflict between the theme and the plugin. Now, I've seen this many times before, this kind of blue oval that sometimes appears over the home page, and it's really annoying, and, and it can shut down your website. People can come to your website, figure out that it's not professional and leave. That's one reason to get shut down. The other reason is sometimes it affects the checkout. Now, after, after figuring out which plugin uh, it was, I deactivated the plugin, checked the website on desktop and mobile, and it was working fine. I then advised the client on another plugin that would serve the same purpose and not affect her site in the same way. So, guys, a lesson to be learned there is do not have too many WordPress plugins. I know it's tempting just to go, oh, that, that plugin does X, Y, and Z. That'll be a great addition to my site. But you've got to remember the more plugins you install, the slower the loading speed and the more, um, the more logic the, the website has to crunch through with every transaction. And it's, it really bogs down the website. This has been proven time and time again over the last 20 years that we've had WordPress. So guys, I hope that helps you today with your website, your WordPress website. If you need more help, please reach out via the link above or below. Stay safe and have a good week. Thanks. Bye.